His mom couldn't be more excited with the way her son is playing today. Love having guests here in the Fantasy Zone studios. Never know who's going to stop by. Very special treat. I hope we can get the theme music actually going here. Stun, stun. Dun, dun. We have Kelly Kiddish of Law and Order. I bet she never hears that ever. Uh, welcoming her into the fan cave here to talk. Come on in, Kel. Come on. Get over here. Great How to are have you. Guys? This is very exciting hey. for me. 16 <laughs> seasons Hi. of Law and Order. <laughs> yeah. And we'll talk about Law and Order, which has taken many a, I don't know, like 10 hour marathon of my life away. Definitely but a let's lot of talk Saturdays, about Sundays, just yeah. hanging out, Nighttime, just watching date all nights. day and night. Exactly. exactly. Absolutely. But first of all, you are a Falcons fan, but also a Texans fan, which I think is really weird. I know it is strange, but I lived in, I lived in Texas and I was doing this show called Chase. Um, and I can't stand the Cowboys. They so like you have to root for somebody <laughs> close by and I, JJ Watt, I'm just, I'm kind of in love with. Oh, who? I like, I literally watched, a little bit. I watched that segment again, like, you know, like the, the things that he's been doing for the Barry family. And like, I was like, Kelly, you can't cry. You're about to be yeah. on camera, you know? But it's just such a sweetheart, you know? And then all this stuff going on with the NFL, like to have, have like guys like that to look up to. So that's why I love the Texans. So now you're, care. but you grew up outside of Atlanta. So what's yeah. it like being a Falcons fan? <laughs> it hurts, <laughs> doesn't it? It hurts. You smiled it off pretty well, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah it, it's, it's great. I mean, it's, you know, we've had some, we've had some good players come through there. And I, when I was little, it was like, Deion Sanders is the man, you know, and then to have Hester break his record yesterday or last, last week. It's so cool, yeah. you know, and I'm really excited about Hester this year. It's like, it's always so great when somebody new comes it. on the scene, you know, yeah. and you, you actually are like, oh, good. You know, Chicago didn't know how to use it. We'll use them. <laughs> finally. You know, finally. Yeah. Did you watch Hard Knocks? Now, I, 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 it was, I, I watched a little bit of it. I felt bad. Who's the, um, the backup quarterback for us? I, like, he was trying to learn the plays. Mm. And, like, I just had to turn it off. I was like, I, this makes it's me hard a nervous to watch, wreck. Right? Yeah. But at the same time, you know, like, watching Hard Knocks actually creates sort of that human element. And that's why so many people get, you know, they start falling in love with the teams and feel Absolutely. that close connection. Absolutely. And, but you also watch a lot of football with your family, too. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we definitely, you know, and it's a, Georgia's a big college football mm -hmm. football place too, which I never really got into that much. You know, I just knew we were Georgia Tech fans. You know, and we watched the Falcons on Sunday. So everybody gets together. I talked to my dad, my brother, like already five times today about what's yeah. been going on. Yeah, I saw you standing here. You had like your arms crossed and you were watching <laughs> you the Falcons. In, you were like, right show me the, the TV. <laughs> Luckily, we have twenty thousand of them right. here in the fan cave. Yeah. Uh, now we got to talk about Law and Order. It's the sixteenth season. You came back in the thirteenth season. You had some pretty big shoes to fill. Yeah, yeah. Um, they had Chris Maloney left, yeah. and um, and also the showrunner. You know, the main guy that writes it, and they had a whole new overhaul. The whole crew was kind of new. They came over from from Criminal Intent because they had just ended. So it was like this whole new fresh blood kind of happening. And I mean, what is I, it like? That's I like wasn't going to be intimidated. Show to be on. It is. It is. And it's a Dick Wolf production. So you know, it's mm -hmm. you know, it's going to be good. And you're going to have a steady job for a little bit. You know, and but the fans were diehard yeah. Maloney, you know, fans. So they were like, What are you doing? What? Are you, who is this? Who's this blondie? Why does she talk funny? <laughs> You know, where's she from? Georgia. Yeah, okay. How's, but your, it, how's your life changed? Uh, I mean, you know, I've gotten to be in New York for, I mean, I, I always lived here. You know, I've lived here 12 years on and off, but I get to, I get to go shopping in better places. I, I like that. <laughs> I, I do like enjoy that. I feel like you can get that. to know the entire city by all the different scene locations. Yeah, exactly. It's so cool. I always, I always talk about that, like um, the locations department. Like they, they, they come up with all the different amazing. spots. I mean, because you sometimes, yeah, New York City, top to bottom absolutely. We'll be on Central Park South in a, in a loft looking out over and just going, holy crap, <laughs> you know, and then we'll be in a basement that's dirty and that hasn't been cleaned, you know, and it, it, you go back and forth. So it is. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. You get to see a lot of new. York. It's the 16th season. You can catch it on Wednesday nights at 9 Eastern. I do believe it's Law and Order SVU. And we have this great. Falcons uh, jacket Aww. on behalf of Tommy, Just but I'm going to give you, but I'm not going to uh, give it to you until you, you give me you give a me? little hint on what's going to happen on <laughs> SVU this season. Um, what, give us a little something. Well, this upcoming week is cool. We've got Stacey Keach okay. coming on, who I'm in love with. Okay. Um, Terry Polo, and we've got my, I think my mom's going to come into town. Okay. Um. It's getting closer. <laughs> got it. All right. Just we'll give that to you. Kelly, you're going to catch her on Law and Order SVU season 16. Let's go live now to Minnesota.